Hi, my name is Mohammed, and today I'm going to discuss a topic is called equations with triangle. So as we discuss about the triangle, uh, how many types of triangles first, which are three types of triangle, which is This is called equilateral, equilateral triangle. This is called isosceles, yeah. Isosceles. And the last one which we discussed about is scalene. So basically there are three types of triangle. So the first one is equilateral triangle. The all sides are equal. So it means the 180 degree uh, is a total angles. So each, each angle is a 60 degree, which I already discussed in my last video. And uh, isosceles has two angles are equal. This is called isosceles and scalene that all angles or all sides are different. So now I'm discussing about how we can work out equation with triangle. So let me take an example. This is equilateral triangle. And the value of this x, this one is x and this one is also x. And the question is what? Okay. Parameter of this triangle. is 78 centimeter so the parameter of this equilateral triangle is 78 centimeter so as we know that what how we work out the parameter so parameter means parameter means you need to add all sides so add all sides to get the parameter. The same way you need to do it, okay? The parameter is already given, which is 78. And add all side, okay? They all are equal, okay? So x plus x plus x so one side second side and third side okay so you need to add all three side so you get 3x equal to 78 i can write like 3x equal to 78 as per equation I need to get rid of this 3 okay so what I am dividing by 3 on the left hand side so I need to divide by right hand side so it means 3 cancel with this 3 so x equal to 78 over 3 so 3 times 2 is 6 and 3 times 6 is 18 so it means x equal to 26 so you found unknown which is x 
okay now the value of x is 26 this value 26 this value is 26 so if we add all sides so you get this 78 so it can match the all side are equals so the all three side value are same which is 26 so how we work about equations with triangles simply as per given questions Perimeter of this triangle 78. The perimeter is size equal to all sides. We add the all three sides equal to 78 and 78 equal to 3x. And you solve this equation to get the answer of value of x, which is 26. Now to move another example. So In this example, I'm taking an equilateral triangle, same, equilateral triangle, and this is, I would say, x plus x plus 1 and this is 7 minus x and this one 2x minus 2 so the question this is equilateral triangle equilateral triangle the value of all three side okay which is the one side is x plus one the second side value is 2x minus 2 and the third side value is 7 minus x and this is equilateral triangle so it means the all side are equal and the examiner asking about okay what is a parameter what is a parameter for this triangle so how we work out the parameter for this example so what we do okay as for the parameter we know that the parameter equal to all sides okay add all side add all sides so what I'm doing, I'm doing parameter equal to x plus 1, okay, that's the one side and the second is 2x minus 2 and the third is 7 minus x. So this is the expression okay as per the given information okay so add all side which is equal to parameter now how we can solve this one okay in this scenario we know that these two sides and also this third one the all are equal okay the values are different but the sides are equal so if I say that I am taking two two sides okay x plus 1 and 2x minus 2 so as for my last example okay so what was the answer you get okay equilateral you get the 26 26 
26. Okay. So it means this 26 equal to this 26 because these are all our sides are equal. The same as I am taking what? I am taking x plus 1 equal to 2x minus 2. Any of them I can take it. Okay. I will discuss the later on this one as well. Okay. So I'm taking these two sides, which is x plus 1 equal to 2x minus 2. So as per the equation, I need to solve x plus 1 equal to 2x minus 2. So in this equation, we need to separate the known from unknown the same way. So what I am doing, okay, I am 2x, here is what, x is plus, so what I am doing, this is x plus and I am doing minus x and this is plus 1. And here I'm doing minus 2. So it means I'm doing plus 2. So if I'm doing plus 2 here, so I need to do plus 2 here as well. Okay. So look at this one. Okay. What, what I'm trying to do. Okay. So as per this is x plus 1. Okay. x plus 1. As it is this one. And this one as it is here, okay? So what I'm doing, okay? I am basically, okay, cancelling this x. So I'm putting here minus x here, okay? So I need to do minus x here as well. So what I'm doing, minus x here as well, okay? So... It means I'm doing minus x here, so I'm doing minus x here. This is minus 2, okay? So if I'm doing plus 2 here, so I need to do plus 2 here as well, okay? So look at that. This minus x, this plus x cancel. 1 plus 2 is 3. And look at this one. This minus 2 cancel with this plus 2 and 2x minus x so it's coming x so it means the value of x which is unknown okay we found which is equal to 3 so now we can put this value to this equation so as I made the equation, the all sides are equal. So what I'm doing? So P equal to X, the value of 3. So 3 plus 1. And then 2 X value is 3. And then 7 minus 3. So I put the value of x in this equation. So I need to simplify. P 3 plus 1 is 4. 2 times 3 is 6. 6 minus 2 is 4. 7 minus 3 is 4. So it means the parameter of this one. 12. So the parameter for this one is 12. And I solve this equation x plus 1 which is equal to 3 plus 1. So x plus 1 which is equal to 4. 2x minus 2 which is equal to 4 and 7 minus x 
which is equal to 4. So it means to add all sides to get the answer which is 12. So it means you can find the parameter as per given question. So add all sides and as per equilateral triangle we know that the two sides all three sides are equal so i taken two side to find out the value of x and after finding this value of x which is i am going to substitute to this equation to find the parameter i I am going to take one more example, okay? I am solving what? I take in, for example, this and this. And now I am taking what? This one, okay? This one and this one, okay? So, for example, I am taking 2x minus 2 because all sides are equal, so I can take any of them, okay? But I need to take 2, okay? So 2x minus 2 equal to 7 minus x. So the same things I need to do it, okay? I need to get rid of, okay, unknown from known. So what I am doing, okay? So 2x minus 2 plus 2 okay and here I'm doing 7 minus x 10 plus x so if I'm doing plus x here okay so I have to do plus x here as well okay and if I'm doing plus 2 here so I need to do plus 2 here as well okay so now look at this this minus this plus cancel. This minus x, this plus cancel. So it means, it means 2x plus 3, 2x plus x, which is 3x, equal to 9, 7 plus 2. And the value of x is coming, x equal to 3 divided by 3, which is 9. So, you found the same value, okay? But this time, I take in 7 minus x equal to 2x minus 2. But the last time, I take in x plus 1, 2x minus 2. Because the all sides are equal. So you can take any of the combination. But the answer will be same, which you are getting x equal to 3. And same, x equal to 3, you need to substitute for this equation to find the value of parameter. So this is the concepts of equation with triangle. And if you like this video, please leave your feedback and see you in the next video. Bye bye.